Shedding is a natural part of our hair's growth cycle. So in most cases, little shedding is normal and nothing to worry about. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, please kindly hit that subscribe button and also don't forget to like this video. So in today's video, I'm going to be prepping my hair for wash day. I'm also going to be talking about an important topic that um, I feel is a lot of concern to many naturals and um, so we are going to be dissecting that topic today as I you know prepare my hair. So in case you're wondering what I'm using for my people today, it's uh, my DIY Moringa oil. I have a video of that on my channel so do check the description box below for full recipe and a link to how I make this oil. So I'm going to be preparing my hair as if you've been following me for a while you know that I always make sure to prepare my hair before applying any shampoo to my hair. So it's almost like I can never shampoo my hair without doing a preparer first. So if I don't have the time to people, I'd rather just, you know, do my wash day in another day instead of just, um, you know, doing my hair or washing my hair without doing a people. So that's just me most of the time, like I said, most of the time. So we're going to be talking about shedding. So shedding is a natural part of our hair's growth cycle, but a lot of people are scared when their hair sheds but in most cases shedding is normal and nothing to worry about so um, according to the american academy of dermatology according to their study we shed 50 to 100 strands of hair per day and this is considered a natural process i know a lot of people still don't agree with that but i would like to say that the most important thing we should rather focus on is understanding how much is too much like there are several factors that can cause ex excessive shedding i'll elaborate more on that in maybe another video but one thing to note is that while you cannot stop your hair from shedding you can actually stop it from shedding excessively if you know what i mean and one way out of several ways which you can do that is taking care of your body internally that is what i mean is your what you do what you take into your system matters a lot your diet and all of that because you cannot be taking care of your hair outwardly and internally you're not healthy or you're not taking proper diet your hair is still going to suffer for it so um, make sure that especially your protein intake per day is met and because our hair is majorly made up of protein a protein called keratin so if there is a protein deficiency your hair follicles can become weak uh, gradually become weak and then your hair begins to fall off so instead of shedding the usual 50 to 100 strands per day you might be shedding a whole lot more than that many people as you know frightened when they lose too much hair but instead of being frightened or scared you should be thinking what are you doing wrong or what are you not doing properly so like i said what you take in matters a lot so you cannot you know starve your um, body internally and you think that whatever you apply on your hair is going to suffice for it no it doesn't work that way as far as natural hair is concerned or any other thing because based on what you take into your body it's going your body is going to select you know which part of your body needs the nutrients the most so places like your kidney your liver your heart important parts of your body system that needs nutrients is going to be catered for first before we are even talking about your hair so <laughs> you want to make sure that you're meeting your internal needs more so that your hair can also get whatever is left then 
um, any additional thing you're doing because your hair and your skin, your nails, they are really not the most important, you know, part to get nutrients um, from your body. So your body focuses on what is more important. Of course, your heart is more important, your liver, your kidney, all these places are more important. Uh, all these parts are more important than your hair of course so you want to make sure that you're taking the right amount of um protein iron because also iron deficiency can you know make one to lose their hair so you want to focus on this part majorly and trust me you're going to see your hair is going to thrive so I just wanted to point these few things out as regards shedding because there's a lot to be said about this topic that we cannot fully, you know, exhaust in this video. So I will save it for another video, but I do hope that um, you understand what I'm trying to say and you understand um, what it means to shed. You know, your shedding comes from the roots of your hair. It comes out in individual strands not um breakage so shedding is different from breakage if you're shedding if you would notice that you're shedding you're going to see some white bulb at the end you know at the roots of um the hair that pulled out so you can just check you know from the hair coming out of your head um for those white bulb if you see those white bulb at the air at the roots of the hair then you know that you're shedding but if you don't see that then that is probably breakage so i do hope that you've learned a thing or two from today's video please if you did kindly give this video a thumbs up like this video guys as you're watching this video like the video share with your friends share with your family and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you have been watching for a while and you have not done so please subscribe to this channel and also i would like you to check the description box below there are links to my playlist i have um, a few playlists that you can check out as well so that you can be able to understand my journey as well as a lot of things that i've been doing on this channel so um i really appreciate you guys watching my videos please do engage with me in the comment section let's interact if you have any questions if you have anything at all that you want to you know probably ask me you can ask me in the comment section and i'll be sure to give you a reply you know as soon as i get your message i'll be there i'm usually in the comment section the first few hours of my video so i will definitely reply to your questions and if there are other videos that you would like to see on this channel do put it also in the comment section and i'll be sure to check it out so thank you once again for watching my videos please don't forget to subscribe like i said and hit that like button so i'm done with my people i'm just going to leave this for a few minutes and then proceed to shampoo my hair as you can see this is the shedding i got from detangling and preparing my hair thank you guys for watching i'll see you in my next video bye